Yo, gamer name here, and welcome back to the city of Krat. Welcome back to Lies of P. So, if you guys remember, we were just about to leave Hotel Krat. <clears throat> we're off to Elysium Boulevard to find Gipeto, who is our creator. Um, so, let's get right into it. No more delays, no delays on the intro. We're jumping straight into it. Okay, so I could actually upgrade my weapon. But I'll hold on to it for now because I do think we can get past Elysium Boulevard with the, our weapon currently the way it is. Um, and from the things I've seen with the trailers, the new trailers and everything, there are a bunch of sick, cool looking weapons. So I want to hold on to all my upgrade material until I like, you know, get a better looking weapon or a cooler looking weapon, you know, higher damage looking weapon. <clears throat> hey, let's be more careful. The Black Rabbit Brotherhood. I hate these guys. Black. But don't be alarmed. My name is Jiminy. We'll talk later when we're safe. Okay, Jiminy. Uh, remember Jiminy Cricket? <laughs> the whole take on Jiminy Cricket. Pretty cool. The Black Rabbit Brotherhood. So what are they about? Like, what's their gig? All right, Stargazer. Activate this right here. Nice save point. We don't need. We don't need anything. Let's get right going. All right, guess our legion. I'm out. Nice, beautiful. Uh, we have some guys at the bottom here. Sneak up behind this guy. Get this guy. Come here. Nice, beautiful. Nice throwing cell. Put our sharpener there. Oh my god. My weapon keeps ricocheting off of... Like, I actually forgot. Every time you fight close to a wall, you can actually just mess yourself up, right? Because the weapon just ricochets off of everything. So, I gotta be mindful of where I fight. I've already used up. Elysian Boulevard was a regular rich people row. You wanted fancy boutiques and shops. <laughs> no place better. But that was long ago. Before, Before the, the puppet, puppet frenzy. frenzy. Right, this is gonna kind of like a bougie place, rich people place. Like it's kind of sad if you think about it, right? <sighs> Alright, so I actually stopped attacking there because I just spoke about being mindful over a fight. Uh, okay. We have... Uh, we have a dog here. We have this guy with the gun. How to take out the guy with the gun first. I parried that. Oh, you can't... No, 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 no. Back up, back up. Back up. Jesus, so you can't block if your back is turned away from the enemy. That's gonna be a problem. That is gonna be a problem. So I'm down to... I don't have any more heals, so I gotta build the heal up. I'm gonna build the heal real quick. I actually have a chest here. Give me something good. Come on, give me something good. A ladder. Okay, defensive parts. So, I believe. Um, this one here ladder F. Increased physical damage reduction. Okay. Needy. Handy. I need that. Let's equip it. Uh, sharpen our blade. Let's not forget. Nice. We have no heals, but we're gonna make it work. I just gotta be a little bit more careful. Alright, so get it closed. We have some stairs here. <coughs> Alright, not a, not the start I would have wanted using two cells already. So this guy here. This guy is the definition of not fighting close to you know, wars, because this is a very bad sport to fight in. You gotta always take out the guy with the gun first. Okay. 
bro. What? Bitch, you better die. Oh my god, and we have a very, very tough opponent right here. Alright, so get our shortcut. <clears throat> Alright, so this guy, this guy, annoying, 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 annoying. Alright, this is our projectiles first. Don't fall, don't fall. Okay. I guess that's GG. Oh shit. Uh is this still alive? Um hello? Um okay. I guess that happened. Uh I really hope he didn't have any like you know materials. Let's pick that right up. Jiminy's emergency protection. That's new. <clears throat> Temporarily protects death ergo when hit. Death ergo? Seems hail from Jiminy when using the death ergo to reclaim. It says the ergo lost from being hit. Wait, so you lose ergo every time you get hit? I had no idea. I did not know about that. Alright. I guess I do now. Nice. Alright, I guess that happened. We move. Uh, I might as well use up my heal. Um, I remember this place. Oh man, such a sad storyline if you think about it. It's so sad, bro. Getting killed by your own creations. No, no, no. Alright, you don't want to fight these things as a group. <laughs> Too far. Nice. Throwing cell. Okay. Pick out this guy. Nice. But I had a heal, no heals. Let's get an ergo right there. So, if you're watching and you're new, guys, it might seem like I'm trying to speed run this, but you know, like I said, I've played the demo. In the first part, this whole part was part of the demo, so I'm kind of very, very familiar with this part. So, so we have a ladder there. So let's go check out what's on the ground. Uh, might be some good materials. Let's see. Do I have any cartridges to refill? Yeah. So let's use this. That's one. It refills up our Legion arm, guys. The cartridges. So use this as well. And use our last one. Nice. Alright. Let's get down. <clears throat> this is new. The slide was not in the demo. Okay, <clears throat> so nothing here. Uh, away from the walls, away from the walls. That's right, that's right. Keep coming, keep coming. Nice. So, as you can see, guys, my weapon is a little bit under leveled, right? It's taking me four hits to down the trash mobs, the guys with the freaking lamps. Also before it took me three hits, so it's kind of a risk. But bro, the weapons I saw in the trailers, best believe I'm saving my shit. Right, so this is a shortcut. So just in case it was worth actually coming down here, don't have to go through around, go through the whole stage again. You know, nice, nice. So. Honestly, like I've seen so many different impressions and reviews, opinions on Lies of P, but like for me, I like it, right? I have to consider the fact that it's actually a small studio, an upcoming studio, maybe like mini indie. There's a guy here actually. Nice. 
right? A mini indie, like an indie game, right? It's doing this well, right? So that's kind of the bright side. So people are trying are trying to dive deep into the, the Blood Bowl and the Elder Ring comparisons. If it had that the same kind of budget, bro, like it would be at that level. There is no doubt about it. Like this is impressive for such a small company or a small studio or whatever you want to call it. Right. Fuck this guy. He didn't, he didn't manage to sneak attack him. Alright, come this way, come this way, buddy. Nice. Got anything for me? Nope. Okay. Just waiting for my element to reduce the Jesus. Oh my god, I need health. I need health so bad right now. Ah. <sighs> Alright, so uh, I need to keep some throw balls because I'm gonna die, bro. Um, throwing cell. Alright. Okay. Ooh, one hit. <laughs> GG, let's go. Nice, beautiful. We need to recharge up our health real quick or we're screwed here. Okay, I guess that worked out. So we need to take out the guy with the freaking throwy balls on the roof. <clears throat> like the game is so unforgiving, bro. This game. Uh, being Dark Souls, obviously. Alright, so... Alright, it's you, huh? Fuck out of here. I need my health back. We have a huge mo we have a huge boss here. There we go. We have a power cell back. Let's use that right up. Nice. Ooh. So this guy without health is going to be quite a problem. But you know, I ain't afraid of no ghosts. We got this. A frozen man's letter. All right. This is some law. I'm going to read all the letters I find in this game for all those interested in the law of the game like me. So if you guys are not interested, just skip through. <clears throat> My Louise in Charlotte, my treasure. I can't hear anything. I think the streets are already dead. Nothing but silence. I assume that I too become just another petrified corpse soon. I still remember the sound of your singing voice and the sight of Charlotte looking at picture books. I miss all of it. The best thing I did when I was alive was send you and Charlotte to the cathedral for shelter. I wish this nightmare was all over. If only you and the kid could come back, but I guess now it's impossible. I love you, Louise. I pray that you're safe there. Kind of sad, you know, considering everything that happened. But let's take a look at the... I think we should really get this one. Remembrance. Bro, that's so deep. That's so deep. Oh, man. That's touching. All right, we get business to attend to. So let's see. Uh, let me equip my blitz as well. All right, so throwable blitz. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, I have three bars of the paper art. So concentrate. 
Alright, so we start with the power cells first. I parried that. What? Oh my god. Ah. Stupid, stupid, stupid. My timing was horrible there. Alright, so let's see. This is our favorite catalyst. We need our ability. Let's let him face backwards first. Let him face back. Jesus, I have to be perfect when I first this guy. Okay, so we'll get our shit. Nice. Oh, I parried that. Look, I'm parrying. I don't understand why I'm missing. It. Oh my god. Get out of here. We got this, we got this. Dude, the attack is so fast. It's so fast. Jesus! Okay, thank you. Alright. I think we get an HP artifact here that kind of helps us. Yeah, we need it. We need it. So, increases max HP. Boom. There we go, slightly bigger health bar, and we even have a stargazer. So the game is forgiving at times, you know, because I have lost so much already. Um, maybe I should upgrade my blade after all. Uh, mm, we'll see, we'll see. Why, hello! <laughs> I didn't know anyone was alive out here. I know what you're thinking, but I'm not a burglar. Okay. I'm just crashing in an abandoned house for a while. That is not Don't worry. sus at all. I won't cause any trouble. <clears throat> we survivors need to look out for each other. Hey, he's right about that, information. though. I didn't steal this. Alright, so let's see. Attribute resistance. Update where increases attribute resistance. So some Legion magazines. I need these. I'll get three. Uh, throwing cell. I'll get bleeds. I'll get okay. I don't need bleeds because the guy I'm fighting is resistant. Ergo, even in death. Oh, this is good. Uh, Trooper protects death. Ergo, I won't buy this weapon. Actually, I, don't th I think I might need it. Um, cause there is a mention that some enemies are weak to electricity, so I'm going to buy this. Remember in the demo, after you complete this section, right, did Ginny mention something about the next level uh, puppets being weak to electricity? So at close range, creates a pool of electric bleeds while it stands. Okay, seems useful. I'll get this as well. Uh, so I might as well just level up my weapons, right? So let's go back to... to craft. Uh, sorry, to... Yeah, to hotel crack and level up our shit. <clears throat> okay, so now I don't exactly know what to level up. I'll try to level up both my weapons. So let's use up all our ergo. Because we are getting destroyed, bro. We just got destroyed. Jesus. Alright, so. Okay. Um, we go to Eugenie. Uh, level I up my way around. our blade. So <clears throat> this has 
physical attack is 110, damage reduction or guarding 50, 54. Physical attack is 61, so less physical attack but has some electric blitz charge attack. So electric blitz attack. Charge power cells 11.0, charge power cells is 10, Fable Art 400. Mm, I have two Moonstones. Okay, so I'll upgrade both, right? Can I? I'll upgrade this, then I'll upgrade this as well. Okay, I'm out of Moonstones, so I might as well upgrade my stats as well. So let me equip. Yeah, so <clears throat> let's level up some stats. Okay. Um, motivity, physical attack, physical attack, legion. Mm. Um, all right, let's get motivity up, technique up. I think everything to 10. For now, use up everything we got, and yeah, we are out. I'll use my power. We are out. Uh, sorry, stargazer are here. Boom, boom, just like that, boys. Just like that, zero time wasted. We're getting right back into it. Easy, <laughs> easy, 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 easy. Okay. <clears throat> All right, let's try not to be as careless as we, what we were before. Uh, so this guy. So much damage, so much damage. Two tap, bro. Just two tap, and he gone. He gone. Nice. Throwing cell. My suit. I uh, take out this guy right here because he has a pistol. Pistol. So we gotta take him out. Nice. Beautiful. Benini's landmark too. <clears throat> this man's attraction, the Alchemist Bridge. The Alchemist Bridge is a bridge on Elysium Boulevard and the main way to Krat City Hotel. The Holy Ouroboros, the mark of the Alchemist, is fittingly engraved onto the bridge. This shows that the Alchemists are not just powerful privileged class but have also donated tremendous amounts of money across the city. Thanks to the thriving culture of philanthropy in Krat, you can find areas with names of prominent figures. It's like the city's motto, the citizens are the owners of the city. Awesome. The most widely known attraction is Rosa Isabella Street. It's named after the culture sponsor, Lady Isabel Monard. But if you think about how the lady is married to the elder of the alchemist Valentinus, you think twice about who really is in control of Krat. The union of Krat's old families and the organization of alchemists is shown in symbolic form. Given that the sacred Ouroboros mark is engraved on the city hall as well, it's obvious who owns the city of Krat. Rating 3 out of 5, a good place to learn about Krat's beginning and its essence. Reporter Meodoro. This guy was really the support of Venini Company. Okay. So this story about the alchemists, right? There's something going on about the alchemists. They seem to be a good folk, like from public perspective, right? Considering how much money you spend on the city, but there's some shady stuff going on in the background, you know. So to be interesting to break down the law. Now, obviously, for me, guys, I'm not that good at like breaking down law in that particular sense. So it take some digging. It is a ladder here, so check out the ladder. But there's a butterfly we have to get here. Wait. I can sense something strange. Jesus, is that a butterfly? Why is the ergo reacting like that? If you want to check it out, I can take points. Okay, a dimensional butterfly will appear in parts of Krat. Munad's land can detect the butterfly lighting up red to point out its location. Okay, so this basically gives you rare loot. We got a moonstone, so we can upgrade our weapon again. 
This weapon is really really slow and it drains a bunch of my stamina, right? So just have to get used to the speed of this weapon. So there are two ladders here. Let's go down from this end first and see what the city of Krat has to offer in the slums at the bottom of this place. Oh man, this guy again? I'm dealing so much damage, it's insane. That was a clutch block. Sheesh! That was a clutch block. Yo, let's go. Alright, sharpen that right up. So this thing does a shitload of damage, bro. Alright, so. What do we have here? More defense parts or another amulet? Workshop Union Installation Converter. Right. Where does this go? Is it here? Uh, okay, just basically buffs my stats again. So improvement. Let's go. <coughs> nice. Nice. This was new. This was not in the demo. Maybe a new side mission. Who is it? Is that you, Murphy? Oh, I guess not. Sorry, I, I thought you were my friend, Murphy. Murphy is a super cool police officer. <coughs> As a puppet, even the petrification disease can't get him. Murphy. I wish I was like him. <coughs> You should leave so you don't catch the disease from me. Hmm, so the petrification disease. So the disease spreading as well. So on top of this shit, you have a disease? Bro, that's kind of messed up. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, any puppets here? We okay, got a bunch of dogs. Nice radiant fragment. This guy, this guys do do so much damage from far. Can't allow him to charge up on me. That's unnecessary cheap damage. Sneak up on the dogo. Okay, nice. Dude, this thing does so much damage. It does so much. Nice. Jiminy's emergency protection. I don't know if I'm using all this shit. Maybe not now. Because I'm familiar with, you know, what happens here. Nice. Ooh, this is a new section. This part was not in the demo. Okay, nice soon. Sneak up on this boy. Sneak up on him. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Bro, lock on. Okay, nice. Another moonstone. Yo, let's go. Nice, a throwing cell. Dude, I haven't actually taken a lot of damage. It's pretty cool. Okay, what do you have for me? Gotta be some cool ass. Dude, like I'm kind of, I can't lie, like I'm kind of scared of what I'll see. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, bro. Like, after the section I'm not familiar with, like, after the section I'm familiar with is done, right? I don't know, like, ah, man. I, like, you guys know, this is my first Souls game, right? I'm not, like, a pro Soul player. So, like, the shit I'm going to find... Uh, shortcut. 
Ah, from the other side. Okay, nice. So let's go back. There should be a ladder somewhere here. We don't have to go. Yeah, there we go. We don't have to go, you know, that far back. How many bars is our super? So we have a three bar and two bar. Okay. So looking at our fable arts, we have a three bar fable art and two bar fable art. Nice. Okay. All right. Let's go. Let's get it. What is this here? Retification disease quarantines or no trespassers. Everyone. Everyone is what? Everyone is a patient or a lunatic. Do not speak to them. So this is a quarantine zone. We spoke to that lady earlier and she said there was a disease going around, right? So that's what they're warning us about here. Oh. This must be your first time in the petrification disease quarantine zone. Yeah. For most people, this is their last stop. You are a good Samaritan for coming all the way here. I mean, I do try. I ain't gonna lie. I am one. May I ask you a favor? Sure, sure. Who am I to say no? My family took my baby from me and sent Same me here. Way. They said it was for my own good, but it was heartless, just the same. A baby must be with its mother. True, true. Please, Please go, go to Crad City to and bring my baby. Okay, I'll find her. Thank you so much, kind one. I can finally see my sweet Elena's face again. That's Please curious. Hurry. spreading across my eyes. Hurt the royal is my side. Please. So this must she be the same. The was at City Hall. Should we check it out? This must be the same oh, shit that Antonia has, safe. right? Antonia, if you guys remember the hotel lady on the wheelchair, the owner of City Grant, she seemed to have the same shit on her face. So it must be the same disease. Okay, so we have this guy. This guy. The damage, the damage, bro. This thing shreds. Oh my god. All right, so let's heal. Get fucked. Okay, we got a new weapon as well, so we got a baton. Let's check it out. Uh, yeah, I wasn't a huge fan of this. The last time as well, so we're gonna unequip it. Uh, unequip. There we go. We we'll stick to our bad boy. There we go. Sheesh. Do the damage. He got destroyed. Uh, Tone Dudo. This is this is new. It itches. Peel the skin and there's blue blood. 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 Pretty cocoon. Blue angel. Joyful appetite. Blue death. What a feast. I'm alive. So I think they're talking about the petrification disease, right? The infection. Damn, that's messed up. Like, dude, imagine... Attention, quarantine zone, okay. Imagine dealing with puppets, right? Then you have this shit as well. You can block the stream. Dude, I do so much damage, it's not even fair. <laughs> it's not even fair. Ultimate defense technique. Destroy an enemy's weapon with a perfect guard. Nice trophy. I don't know if you guys can see that. Ah, right, I forgot about you. Two hits, bro. Like, bro, that's insane. This thing does so much. 
Okay, so this is an elevator shortcut that takes us back to the merchant. Let's repair it and get right back up. Right, right back up. I think I'll even get some more throwables. The throwing cell is actually ridiculous, right? It does so much damage. Uh, move to equipment. I need to equip this as well. Extra bag. Um, temporary protects death ergo. Um, this is an extra bag as well. Okay, so this we're gonna put this here. Uh, uh, lower back. We're gonna put a legion arm. Okay. We have one slot left. Uh, let's put. I mean, not as well just use a repair tool, right? Okay. <clears throat> Let's get some shit from our boy. Uh, the throwing cell is OP. It does so much damage. I can get three maximum. Uh, might as well get some more legion arm because this thing is useful. We have 700 left. I think, I think that's all. Electric bleed sky. We don't need that. I think that's all. Yeah. <clears throat> all right. We're going back down. Nice, like it feels so natural to me because I've played this so many times and I'll keep saying this like I've played it so so many times Bro like Like I'm so excited because I know what's coming. I have seen the trailers. I've watched so many trailers, right? The weapons like when I when do I start getting the legion arms? Right, so for me, I'm just hella excited. Like it's just so excited Alright, I uh, shut my blade Puppets, purge puppets. Mm. Come out, Geppetto! You've got a lot to answer for! <clears throat> you know what caused the puppet frenzy, don't you? You're their maker, practically their father! You and the alchemist scheming together. Tell me the truth! What's your problem? I'm here for the old man. Get lost. Wait. I know you. Or more like I know what you are. You're the devil's puppet. You can't sneak past me. Oh, let's go then. Die! Go. Let's go. Jesus. The secret beating this guy is going at his back. Go to his back. One, two, three. I'll kill you both, then string you up on the bridge. Jeez. Jeez. But my range is bad. My damage ain't bad though. Are you a dream or a nightmare? Oh my god. Bro, the damage is ridiculous. What the hell is this damage? Like a mad donkey was also an easy boss or like a mini boss. So not really that surprising, honestly. <clears throat> and there he is, our creator, G Pedal. <clears throat> Finally, <laughs> we meet. Son. Son. Like, I don't know, I just love the idea of 
the duck being like, this is new, new animation. Yes. Okay. I understand why some people despise me. I invented the puppets after all. I should take responsibility as their maker. But in order for me to do that, I need to take care of the puppets at City Hall. <clears throat> Won't you help me, son? Take this. You'll find it most useful. Nice. A key, Crack City Hall key, Mad Donkey costume. Okay. So Gipetto is the creator of the puppets. I think we all knew that, right? Because he also created me. I want to hear all about your experiences. But now isn't a good time. Use the stalker's key to open the bridge door. Then get rid of the frenzied puppets that have seized City Hall. I bet. We'll catch up at Hotel Croc when you're done. Okay, father. N n nice talking to you. Uh, so he is the creator of the puppets, right? Um, and Mad Donkey was pissed because he discovered that he actually created the puppets. Like, who wouldn't be, guys? Like, brought freaking Armageddon on the whole entire world, right? So, ooh, a moonstone. Yo, this was a tier before. That's like, what, three now? So yeah, I, can, I, can, I, can, I can switch around the world of weapons now because I have so many stones. Nice. Use I use the quality. Oh, we also have got some drip. Uh, why do I costume? There we go. So we have Mad Donkey's outfit. I don't like the helmet, the donkey outfit. You gotta get the full thing, but yeah, I'm gonna unequip this. Just the bottom. Now I look like a blood bone. Sheesh. Stargazer. I see. Okay, let's see what the Stargazer gives so us. So about that weapon assembly tool you Ooh, were talking about. Oh yeah, the about. weapon assembly, okay. If you find any more weapons, let's try using them here. Okay, so... Uh, switch Legion Arm, assemble weapons. Assemble weapons through Eugenie at the hotel or at the Stargazers in different areas. Separate your weapons into blade and handle and assemble them into new weapons that match your character's battle style. All weapons, feature are, all weapons features I decided by the handle and the blade combo. Okay, so this is what makes Slice of P very, very unique when it comes to the weapon system, right? It's the assembly system. So, basically, to make you guys understand, you have blades and handles. So, so these are the blades, then these are the handles. So, the handles and the blades come with their own different unique movesets. Uh, move lists and stats. So for example, um, right, I'm using the coil weapon right now, full coil, right? So I can attach the blade handle in the coil head to have like a different playstyle. So let me just demonstrate that for you guys. So uh, assemble weapon. So this is our default weapon. So we're going to use uh, the handle of the freaking electro weapon. Just, just to show you guys. So this and... No, no, the blade and the electro handle. Assemble weapon. Okay. Uh, wait, I'm supposed to equip it first. Um, Jesus. I'm old. Uh, equip it. So, see, guys, this is a, like our new blade, right? So, the normal weapons change, the normal attacks, or the light attacks change. Uh, our heavy attack changes as well. Right? It gets the ability of the Electro Weapon because the handle comes with different abilities. And then we can take a look at the, the Fable Arts as well, so bottom right corner. So all two abilities use up three bars. My default weapon before only had one that could use three bars and one that could use one bar. Remember the weapon buff? I was getting the attack buff. But with this one, it changes. So just to show you guys the more different combinations, let's do this. Uh, assemble weapons, so the disassemble. Uh, new weapon handle. So let's try the electro head and our blades handle, right? So assemble, yes. Uh, 
equip as well. Alright, so now we have our abilities. The blades abilities. Remember this was our light attack? Well, and this was our heavy attack. One, two. But we have the freaking electro head. Now this is my favorite weapon, but the thing I don't like using about this is because the last boss we fight is actually imbued with electricity. So I think he takes less damage. So for the sake of this video, I'm just going to try a whole new combo uh, that I haven't yet tried. So let's disassemble this. Then let's try the baton head with the electro handle. Let's see how that looks. Uh, wait. <sighs> equip, Nemi. Equip. Okay. That's our light attack. That's our heavy attack. Uh, I don't know. I don't like the range, right? The range is too short. Oh man. The range is too short. Let's try something else. Let's see. What else can we do? Assemble. Uh, disassemble this. So let's try the blade with the baton. Mm. Let's try the baton handle. Let's see how this looks. Equip, you idiot. Oh my god. Alright, so... Right, the baton move list. I'm not a fan of the baton. Oh, no, I'm not a fan of the baton move list. All right, so let's go with the blade with the electro handle. So assemble the pawn, disassemble. Yes, here the pawn. The blade with the electro handle. Assemble. Yes. Equip you idiot. All right, so this one we're going to use this because it has good range. Not a fan of the light attack though. The heavy is not too bad. Yeah, but for the sake of this video, just a different play style. Might as well just try it out. Then let's go back to the hotel and let's level up. It's a new weapon, gonna level it up. Beautiful. Beautiful. Let's get it. Uh, we use up our ergo first. Uh, use two, use two, beautiful. I know there's an easier way to access those items, but you know I'm an idiot, so I know my way around. Okay, upgrade weapon. Let's upgrade the blade. Uh yeah. Gucci. What does all level up again? Alright, use up all our ergo because we are approaching the final boss. Oh, okay. Spoiler alert. More health, let's go 11. Uh, stamina, not much. Legion arm. Uh, Legion arm. Okay, so. Okay, let's get that to 11. Motivity, physical attack. Alright, I'm using a physical attack. I'm gonna change my Legion arm back to the default because I think that one deals more damage. And I think it's better against the boss we're about to face. And it does have physical attack, right? So we just leveled up physical attack, so we'll deal more damage. Uh, let's mess around with our equipment. So let's add the Legion arm, um, the Legion magazine. Let's add this is a fable, fable. Electro bleeds won't be needed because the boss is electro, like I said earlier. So we're gonna add. Removes attributes to this army. So we're gonna add this electro resistance because remember it gives us resistance against elements. So again, the boss we're facing is gonna be electro based. So uh, yeah, let's get it. We're ready. Use the teleport, city crat hole, and let's get it. Beautiful. Okay, city crat hole. Let's clear the boys up. So we have this guy here. No! Oh my god, it's a bit slow, right? I'm not used to it yet. Ah. Oh, nice, went to his back. 
Nice! That was easier than I expected. Nice, got more resistant attitude. Stuff fragment here. Okay. Nice. They give us so many of these, right? I think it's because of the boss. Nice. We shouldn't have ah, we shouldn't have taken any damage there. Mm, I think we have a shortcut here. Oh, who this? Oh, so this might be what happens when the disease is like, you know, 100% filled up. Like, you know how the lady on the window said it's spreading and she can't breathe until she's not able to see? So I think this might be the fate once everything is... Oh my god, this, this is dark. This is so sad. Okay, let's get that ergo. Open up. Hey, you. Okay, nice fragment. Okay. <clears throat> no, 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 no. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Dude. I'm being fucking... Oh my god, I've lost so much health. And we have two more here. Alright, oh, we have this dude again. Oh my god, at the wrong freaking time. Quite news issue, one, one, two, four. Ah, Venini's, Mr. Venini's ambition to make a jolly police mascot puppet for City Hall ended in failure. His passion to make a trustworthy friend for the citizens and a strong officer who overpowers criminals was in high was in the right place, but turned out to be excessive. The new police's office, the new police officer's puppet overcharged storage battery exceeded its capacity, causing chain explosions, malfunctions, and serious body damage. The city council recommended disposing of the puppet on the grounds that its appearance intimidates visitors. Mr. But Mr. Venini and the taxpayers protested, holding the council's plan to its tracks. The puppet still lies abandoned behind City Hall to this day whilst the lawsuit is ongoing. The interesting thing is, even when the puppet is unattended, it performs a number on, of its mascot roles. It is especially popular with kids and even appears to react and respond to playing of children. However, it has led to more slum children entering the city hall, causing inconvenience to visitors. The city council is considering about only occasionally exhibiting the puppet as means of restrict entrance. Means to restrict entrance. So this is a bit of law on the boss we are about to face. You guys are gonna see him, but... Ah, let's deal with this guy first. Oh, man. Uh... Let's see, I might as well use my blitz, right? Oh, this guy. No, I healed by me. Oh no, that's GG's. That's GG's. Jesus, I parried. The weapon is a bit slow, I'm not a huge fan of it, but like the damage seems good. Like, the damage is really really good. Uh, let's sharpen that up. Let's say sharpen that up. Okay, let's equip our Legion magazine back up. Oh no. No survivors here. What do we do? Just give her that baby puppet? Okay, so I think we have to take it back to the lady on the window. So let's do that real quick. Uh, I think she's down here. Is she really that far back? I don't remember. Uh, she's over. She's down this way, right across the bridge. 
Oh, do you still have to face those guys again? Jesus. So again, I think these are like side missions, so you do have the option not to do them, right? But I think we do get something for helping her out, right? So we might as well just do it. Oh no, not a good idea facing these two at the same time. Alright. Uh, yeah, guys, facing these two at the same time, not a good idea. I had no health, so it is what it is, you know. It'd be what it'd be. It'd be, it'd be like that sometimes, you know. Uh, I think I should have used the other Legion arm. The other Legion arm is better against these guys. So, alright, let's see. Let's run it back. Run it back, Turbo. Oh man, dude, the design, the level design as well. Just everything. And this is on the Series S, guys. The Series S. Not the X of the PS5, just the Series X. The Series S, right? So, just imagine. Alright, come right up. Yeah, yeah, just, just follow me. Follow me. Let's talk about it. Jesus, the damage. The weapon is slow. Like, the light attacks are slow as well, so it's kind of weird. Dude, he parries as well. That's stupid. That's so stupid. Okay. Dude, like the light attacks for this weapon are just throwing me off. I'm not a huge fan, you know, but for the sake of all you guys, I'm gonna do it, right? I'm gonna do it. Oh, handicapped and shit, but, you know. <clears throat> you found her, Guide One. I could sense her from miles away. Oh, my sweet Elena. Please let me hold her. Dude, look at her arm. <laughs> there, there. Her hand right out the window. Like what? I missed you so much. What do you think? Is my baby adorable? It's a puppet. She's a cute baby. So, so here we're gonna lie, right? We're breaking outside our. That's right. Our natural way of life as being a puppet. So we keep lying. You've granted me my only wish. My sweet Elena. We're going to be happy now. Thank you so much. Kind of. Feel. Clear Ergo. Ooh. So that's just like um, a freaking record we can play at the hotel. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys right after we beat this boss. Zero damage, zero deaths. Right here, right now. <laughs> you comfortable? You got your cold ones, my boys? You got them snuckles ready? Because this is gonna be the cleanest run you ever see in the lives of P. Uh, so let's get back up to our stargazer we have to use it guys we need uh wait up ourselves right we have three we can carry four total so we need this back i do have that shortcut i created earlier so yeah there we go nice and healthy chunky um get all our equipment up all right so let's get it all right these guys respawn right yeah so you know this guy Know this guy. You can know both these guys. I don't need you. Right? Use a staff fragment at the cracks calling next to the boss area to summon a spectre. It will help you it will help your character in the boss battle. So yeah, we can summon a spectre guys if you want. Uh, basically it just helps you in the battle. 
if you don't want to sweat, right, if you need help against very tough bosses, you can use the speakers if you want, but I am not going to use it because it's actually really fun studying the enemy, figuring out their moves and stuff, so I'll choose not to. Let's get it. Zero damage. Zero deaths. I don't, I haven't even checked my Fable abilities for this weapon. Oh my god. Such a screw. So like, <laughs> how was this guy supposed to be a jolly? Anyway, I mean, if you look back in the era, like back in the years, we did have some creepy stuff, right? So I wouldn't be surprised. If someone created this, looked at it, and thought it looked good. Alright, so I don't remember his move list, but... I parried that, hello? No, I parried that. Hello? Dude, the uh this, this weapon is throwing me off. It's so slow. Okay, Grogi. Get the buff, whatever it does. No, I... Oh my god, I missed it. Such a scrub, bro. Okay, that's phase two now. Nice. Come on, grab. Ooh. Oh, I buried that. Oh my god. Heal up, heal up, heal up. Come on, girl, come on, girl. Okay. Nice. Oh, fuck. I parried. Hello? I'm one hit, I'm one hit. So close so close guys the weapon is kind of throwing you off like it's so slow the recovery on the normal attacks is not as good as the blade so i keep on like i have to just readjust to the playstyle of this weapon right so it still counts as zero deaths by the way just saying you know i did this for y'all so not a fan of the weapon but we've already committed right we've leveled it up so we have to finish this we have to finish this. i forgot to use my Freaking uh, electro resistance potion as well, so nope, nope, I ain't got time for y'all. All right, all right, so we have two bar, sorry, both our abilities are three bars, right? We, we only have three bar fable art abilities, so I shouldn't forget that. Okay, uh, I also dropped my groggy attack as well. Dude, like... Look at that, that recovery! The recovery!
It takes up so much stamina. Back up, I need to heal. Yeah, heal up. Nice. Okay. But maybe I'll use my table attack for this easy now. Nice. Command grab, command grab, back up, back up, heal up. Nice, beautiful. Ah. Potion. Uh, let's sharpen up, sharpen up, sharpen up, sharpen up. Beautiful. Nice. Uh, I missed the fire on that one. Nice. Back up. Come on, girl. Up so much stamina. Nice, easy, easy. Come on, grab. Nice running attack. Ah, I keep forgetting about the second hit. Nice. No, I parried that, I parried that. Pila, pila, pila. Get your ass down. Oh, you're mine. You're mine. Get out. Let's go. Sheesh. Easy. Easy. Beautiful. Nice! That was the final boss of the demo, guys. Spoiler alert. So, like, oh man, that was fun. <laughs> that was fun. I love this game so much. The attacks on that guy, like the wind up animation on the attack. Sorry, might as well just heal, right? The wind up animation of the attack, the second phase with the electricity, the law on the boss. Like, I just love everything about it, right? Oh man. I'm not a fan of this weapon, but that. God damn. It does some serious damage when you give this guy dear citizens. The factory has been occupied by the puppets. Whatever the cause, Venini company is responsible for it. I, Lorenzini Venini, am going alone to stop those devils. The factory is very dangerous now. Stay out of it and keep safe. The rest I will leave for Mr. Gippetto, whom I trust more than anyone. So Venini is in charge of the factory. He's the leader of the factory. Or owns or runs the factory so he's in charge of the puppet production right so he seems to be missing and I think it's the next chapter of the story Whew, I think we're done here pal back to the hotel back to the hotel as like as for a demo getting three bosses right the parade master you know mad donkey in the cop like that's a lot for a demo guys that's a lot right very very fun as well all fun fights Maybe uh, for Mad Donkey, not as much. He was more like a mini boss rather than a boss, right? But like for the rest, oh my god, the freaking scrapped watchman, dude. The first time I fought this guy, bro, I died. I hella died. And it was really, really annoying, honestly. But like I say, that's kind of the, the game plan with Souls games. You die, 
you live and you learn. So let's take to Sophia. You saved Geppetto. Wonderful. Thank you. He's on the second floor. He can hardly wait to see you. Oh, let's see if Antonia has anything to say. That sounds very dangerous. Geppetto, you the pain of his grief may be clouding his judgment. You and Geppetto are always welcome at this hotel. Geppetto's room is on the second floor. You people have no idea thanks for keeping me company. About lying about Geppetto. I am an old friend of Geppetto's. His son is like family to me. Make yourself at home. You are always welcome here at the hotel. If you have any questions, ask my butler, Polandina. I see you're here. That means you can lie. Yeah, yeah. Your lives are a rare ability. You're able to choose your own path, unbound by anything. People on the outside are still afraid of puppets. Lie to protect yourself. And find your you. own path. Okay. So it seems we're the only puppet that can lie, you know, make it as unique. So we have another puppet here. Like, this is something that really irked me as well. Like, amongst all the puppets we've seen in this world, we are the only ones that are really, like, you know, working around the laws, like the four laws, right? I don't know what the other laws are. Then we have this dude as well. Like, this is the only other puppet we've seen so far that isn't really, like, crazy or, like, frenzied. Right? Hotel Croft. My name is Polandina. Butler to Lady Antonia. Please let me know how I may be of service. At Hotel Krat, comfort and calm walk hand in hand. Welcome to Hotel Krat. How may I be of service? A chess. Oh, we could get some items from him and sell some stuff. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Wait. To... Uh, what's this? Poor P organability. Ah, okay. Never mind. Then remember the record guys we got from the lady with the baby? So this is where we place it and play it. Like how awesome is that, right? Close your eyes. <sighs> Come to me. Feel Bro, this game, remember this moment? I just felt it was just the feeling I had when I first heard this song on my first playthrough. Like the the feelings I got from playing this song the first time. I don't know man. Right. <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. Of high powered energy originating far away. That's one mystery solved. Why don't we make a legion arm with it? Mr. Vanini is the expert when it comes to legion arms, but I'm pretty sure I can make one. The puppets get fried easily by electricity. If you use an electric legion arm, it'll make your life easier. You're going to the factory to save Mr. Vanini, right? He's the richest man in Krat. A little eccentric, maybe. But, but a good person. A good person. I heard he went to shut the factory down. Hmm. I hope he's safe. I wouldn't want to lose my best customer. So, Eugenie is in charge of Weapon Upgrades. Uh, Gepetto was a creator of the puppets and is in charge of like the P.O. gun upgrades, which is like the skill tree I will show you guys earlier. Then Venini, the one we're supposed to go save in the next chapter, is in charge of the Legion Arms. He builds a Legion Arm, so we get a new Legion Arm here, uh, the Electro Legion Arm, right? So it has three abilities, enables moving while charging electric plates, uh, continuous, continuous small sparks from the hand, inflict damage while charging electric blades. Increases the maximum level of charging. So I was gonna say the voice acting is a little bit meh. On that, I will not even lie. All right, so we have a new weapon here. So 
the same combo that we had. Oh my god, I have to upgrade it. So basically, the combos of the blades, but with an electric coil. Because as she said, electricity is good against where we're going. So even for the Legion arm. That's gonna be hard to use bro. Like just standing still like this. I mean, okay. We're gonna try it out, you know, but you need to upgrade that weapon. It's very, very low. I know my way around the weapon. Upgrade weapon. Upgrade blade. The springs are reacting. Why? Okay, I need two to upgrade it again. Alright. Uh, 8,000. Uh, upgrade our stats a bit. Um, oh, I have to go to Sophia for that. You saved Geppetto. Wonderful. Thank you, Soph. He is on the second floor. He can hardly wait to see you. Oh, nice. I'll use my power to help. Okay, level up. Because <clears throat> this place we're going to should be mine. So, vitality. 6,000 left. Uh, Legion arm. Since I'm using an electric blitz weapon, I should upgrade everything that has electricity on it. Just for the sake of it. Okay? I have 2,000 ergo left, might as well get this to 11 capacity, alright, for now, for now, if shit is hard, in Vinini's factory, we're gonna come back and upgrade more shit, as for now, I think this is good, alright father, let us talk, ah, you've returned, Forgive a sentimental father for worrying about his son. Always remember that you're precious to me. Okay. Even when I ask you to do something dangerous. I believe you, bro. Speaking of which, there's a factory just beyond the Lycian Boulevard. It's packed countless with of countless puppets. puppets. Jesus. My friend, the inventor Vinini, went to stop them, but he never came back. Please, go save him and shut down the factory. Alright. Pea organs are the source of your powers. Collect quartz to get the strength you need. <coughs> oh shit, excuse me. Dude, it's so cool. The mechanical heart. That's so cool. Remember, the hotel is the last safe place in Krat. It's our only refuge in a city full of perils. It'll be extremely dangerous if anyone has ill intentions. All right, bet. Be careful who you tell about this place, especially if they're stalkers or alchemists. Okay. Be wary of dangerous people. Like the stalkers and the alchemists, I need more. We need more information on those. Use the PO gun slots to activate your character's latent abilities. Equip quads on the PO gun to obtain its course. Jesus, the music is going. Bro. Nani? Equip quads on the PO gun to obtain its corresponding effect. If you equip quads in each of the slots in a single group, you can gain group synergy effect. Each time synergy effects of two groups are activated, the next step is unlocked. You can get a great variety of effects as you take your PO gun to higher phases. So this is basically the skill tree. So the quartz we've been getting is kind of used for this. So we have phase one, phase two, phase three, four, bro, up to five. That's kind of big considering we do have a legion arm as well. We have this fable art, so that's kind of a lot. Okay, so let's see the first one. Uh, increases power cell. Increases mighty number. This one is good, bro. More health. Uh, the second one, link dodge, enables dodge in the middle of dodge, which we can dodge and dodge again, which is okay, but I think parry is more valuable than dodging, right? We haven't really had a problem of dodging, so I'm gonna leave this one. 
You increase stagger the window. I think I've been getting those. It's good, but I've been getting those. Add Fable slots plus one. Hmm. Now this one. Okay, so it's for the power cell. Or the, I'm going to go for the power cell because I hate running out of health, right? We need to live a little longer. Our damage is good, so we're going for power cell. Okay, so enhance charge attack uh, stagger, enhance fatal attack, enhance fatal attack, increases dodge stagger duration, enhance charge attack stagger attack. Mm. I'm going to go for Fable Art because um, it because you know the damage that one window that I need for damage I'll take full advantage of it so I have uh, we cannot equip quads with the same type okay oh there's attack type survival type ability type item type there's so much shit bro. Enhanced guard regain recovery, enhanced fatal attack, power cell charge, lower damage with discharge, lower damage with dodging, charge, charge legion when eliminating an enemy. I need this. Yes, yes. I don't even care about the rest of the abilities. Okay, so I've used two. Um, let's go with Fable. So do I still have more quads or I still have one more? Oh, so it's the same. Okay, okay, this makes sense now. So I should as well go for Legion Magazine Enhanced Effect. So this is Ergo upon Mission Enemy. This is Consumable Position Limit. Lowers Attack Charge. Stamina Consumption. Perfect Dead Fable Charge Enhance. Hmm. Fable Charge Enhance. Perfect Guard. Enhance fatal attack power cell charge. Okay, I'm gonna go for perfect guard, fable enhance. Good enough quads. Alright, I'll run out. So we need more. Okay. Alright. Okay, we're done here, right? The city of Christ. Ask me any question. About Vinini works, about St. Frangelo Cathedral. Okay, let's talk. <clears throat> It's a factory where they manufacture more themselves. Dude, they can manufacture more of themselves? That's what I say. Stop them, but I'm worried. He's an industrialist, what not a fighter. fighter. Rescue Vanini and shut down his factory. That will deny the puppets their reinforcements. Okay. Um, about St. Frangelo Cathedral. The cathedral is famous for its wise and kind Archbishop Andreas. He offers sanctuary to countless refugees there. The thing is, I've lost touch with them. Perhaps no news is good news. And if the puppets push towards the cathedral, it could go save it could be Okay, go so we have to go to the, the church as well. Okay. About Malam district? I don't know what's happening in the Malam district. The Black Rabbit Brotherhood Black sees the neighborhood. That's all I know. So Germany mentioned the it Black Rabbit Brotherhood as well. Neighborhood, but it's descended into anarchy. Or I'm hearing rumors of Who monsters rampaging, rampaging through, the through the district. Those poor... So these, I think, are the levels, right? So the factory... Cathedral, a district in the street. Rosa Isabel Street is a stronghold of the puppets. It's a hunting ground where the most dangerous puppets are. Okay, end game stuff. I believe it's the epicenter of the puppet, puppet frenzy. frenzy. After all, I detected the strongest wave of ergo there. Damn. Especially for someone as precious as you. It's a perilous place. And when you walk a dangerous path, my Just son. To take one step at a time. Okay, so keep this in mind, guys. This might be the level that we meet, right? The factory, cathedral, the district, and Isabella Street. We did see Rosa Isabella Street in the trailers, in the factory as well. You can get from City Hall to the factory with the key I just gave you. Okay, all right, thank you, Father. You gave me that key. And now he's missing. Rescue him if you can. 
Alright, so let's see, where do we find the place to go to the factory? Do we have to go back to the boss area section? The key he gave me, right what about here? Rosa Isabella shoot key, okay. I think it should be that door we tried to unlock after fighting the puppet master. Okay, so yeah, city hall courtyard, right? <clears throat> Let's find out. Okay, uh, so I believe the door was somewhere here. Uh, here, right? This side. Back here? Am I tripping? Yeah, this was a door, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so... Alright, I think, yeah, that's the factory. So that's where we're headed. So guys, I think this is a good place to leave it for part 2, chapter 2. It's been a long ass chapter, actually. So some new enemy types, look at that. What is he holding? Is that a projectile? Yeah, so I think it's a good place, a good time to end it, guys. Um, man, this has been an awesome playthrough. Like, this has been awesome. Despite playing this game so many times. Actually, I think I'm going to buy some other stuff. So I'll do that in the next playthrough. <laughs> so anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoyed my video. Please look forward to part 3. Uh, coming soon, going into Benini's factory. I really hope you're enjoying this game as much as I am, guys. Oof, it's an amazing game so far so good so anyway guys gg please 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 leave a like button we need to get these likes of the videos to do well you and me both bro so gg guys subscribe if you haven't and take care